So hello guys welcome back to the channel I hope you all are absolutely fine and sound and you might be excited regarding the arcade facilitator program and if you don't know about this program first of all come to the post section and just first of all fill this form use this referral code to join and here you can join the program and win exciting google cloud goodies if you need help like how to fill the form you can click on this video link and watch it carefully now if you are completely new to this channel, do like the video and subscribe the channel. Now let's move to the next step. So once you have filled the form and received the confirmation email like this, this is how the confirmation email looks like. It will take 24 to 48 hours to come in your mailbox if you have filled all the details correctly. I am suggesting watch the video along with filling the form so that you don't make any mistake. Now come over here. The second thing is that once you have filled the form, you need to redeem the credits. In the email, there is a code to redeem the credits okay so for redeeming the credits many of you are facing issue so here is the video you can watch it and claim your credits very easily now let's move to the main topic basically here we are talking about the syllabus for the arcade facilitator program now we are surely enrolled in the program and redeem the credits also so now what is the next step basically we have to complete some games and some skill badges and some lab free courses everything will be covered here in detail and let's start so basically here in the arcade facilitated program unlike the arcade program here we get bonus points and which we can use to redeem the swag so you can think like arcade is a principal and arcade facilitator is a teacher or employee of that company okay now i hope this analogy helps you to understand the event now here you'll complete some points basically games and you'll be getting some points and in return you'll get some bonus points so let's discover the syllabus so here you can see these are the arcade games okay these are the arcade games and each arcade games give one arcade point except that special arcade points that is the two pointer game and one more important thing i want to say if you know about the work meet play many of you don't know about the work meet play so let me show you about the work meet play so basically in the arcade facilitator program, they are not counting the work meet play game. Here, I think the game was expired recently only. Yes, this type of game that is basically which says that top 50 will be awarded the basically points. This game is not being counted. Only the games mentioned here like level 1, level 2, level 3, base camp, certification zone and the monthly special game will be counted including all the 4 trivias. Okay, now all the 4 trivias and games are live already. Now the next thing is that here in the two months you will have 12 game badges. Sorry, in the next two cohort, basically in the complete cohort we will be having 12 game badges. And then here basically you have to complete some of them. How many you have to complete? Let me show you. So basically they have in the point system they have mentioned the syllabus clearly. So here we have milestone 1, milestone 2, milestone 3 and milestone 4 basically the ultimate milestone. So basically in the uh, milestone one, we have to complete six games and that six games will give six arcade points. And for the basically the trivia games, we have five trivia games, five points. Similarly, skill badges, you must be knowing two skill badge gifts, seven arcade points. Now you may be worried, I will find the skill badges and the solutions. Don't worry, all things including the lab free courses, I'll be providing so that you'll be able to complete this program very easily and without any issue. So here you can see we have to complete 52 skill badges. If you are targeting for the legend milestone basically which will be around 90 to 95 points in this cohort earlier it was 85 points. Chances are there they may increase or not. So if you are targeting thing, this thing then you have to complete all the 52 skill badges. Now let's cover the main thing regarding the syllabus. So basically the syllabus is simple. You have to complete the arcade games and then you have to complete the skill badges. So basically here they have mentioned the skill badges also and the arcade games also and the lab free courses. You can see here lab free courses are here. Basically lab free courses are simple thing. Let me show you. Basically it consists of some quizzes and videos. You have to just attend the quizzes and then just answer it. Okay. And for the lab free courses as I said earlier all the resources are available on the channel. You have to explore it. And I have created a dedicated sheet which will help you to complete these things. And let us me let me show you what will be the main thing you have to do. So basically here are the milestones. Basically the syllabus and milestone mean same thing. So here you have to, what you have to complete? The arcade games. So each month there will be some arcade games. Basically 10 arcade games will be here. 
and you'll be getting each month 11 arcade points normally okay but for the arcade facilitator eligibility you have to complete six arcade games and five trivia games when i am saying you'll be getting 11 arcade points basically on the 10 games out of which four are just trivia games let me show you here so here you can see it clearly four are trivia games and the remaining one two three four and one more i think five will be there okay so five will be there and one more basically two will be there so here we can understand seven or eleven okay i hope you understand what i am trying to say that here we have the special game which will give two points then a certification zone which will give one point we have three points now for base camp four points level four five points and six seven now for the these all we will having four points now if we consider the game badges we'll have 10 game badge total now here for being eligible for the swags you have to be in these milestone okay i hope it clears your doubt that you have to be in these milestone now regarding a milestone query will you get if you complete both the milestone will you get the both the points so answer is simple no now let's cover the resources first of all i hope this clears your doubt regarding a milestone you have to complete all these games and then you'll be able to get the bonus points and for the bonus lab free courses are also there how i'm going to show you so the first step is that you have to complete the pre-assessment batch okay first of all complete the pre-assessment batch let me show you which batch you have to complete the pre-assessment batch okay so from here you can see all these pre-assessment badge are here so what are pre-assessment badge basically when you complete when you open any of these labs you'll see that it will show a pre-assessment thing over here so you can see go to pre-assessment it's showing when you'll click on it you will be redirected to a page and simply you have to just complete that last lab and you'll get the badge without any issue so here are the complete solution guides for it watch it and complete it here mostly 13 labs are there so you are getting 13 badge basically if you cut down to at least you are getting basically in 0.5 there points are not added so you can just consider it to one more skill badge so but just by doing one more complete skill badge you will be getting the 14 basically 14 skill badges that means 7 arcade points so that's clears your doubt basically i think so so basically this was the main thing which i wanted to share with you now regarding the lab free courses here you can see the lab free courses okay so here are the lab free courses here is the direct url for the lab free courses and here is the solution video regarding the lab free courses so i have covered each and everything you can watch it and complete it with ease now regarding the skill badges once you have completed the lab free courses and the basically what we call the pre assessment skill badges you have to complete skill badges now as per the syllabus we have to complete 52 skill badges now here we have clearly mentioned that all the skill badges you can see here i think 55 plus skill badges are there including the including this lab free course sorry including the 12 labs 12 skill badges okay so basically you need to understand that you have to just complete all these badges start from anyone you can start it some of them are working some are facing issue do not worry try to complete the next skill badges and you'll be able to get the most of it and if you face any issue you can let me know in the comment section this was basically the resources video how you have to complete all these things and regarding the point system we'll make another video so that's all about this video thank you have a great day